Hey guys, welcome back, I'm Jay. In this episode, we're gonna look at one of AWS Edge services, Amazon CloudFront. Amazon CloudFront is a fast content delivery network or CDN service that securely delivers data, media files, applications and APIs to customers around the world. CloudFront speeds up the distribution of your static and dynamic content, such as HTML, CSS, JS files, images and videos, to your users using the global edge locations. CloudFront leverages over 200 edge locations for content caching, and uses a highly resilient Amazon backbone network to deliver content, with high performance and high availability to your end users. CloudFront is a highly secure, fast and smart CDN service. It has a variety of built-in protection features, such as AWS Shield standard for DDoS mitigation at no additional cost. CloudFront also works with AWS Certificate Manager or ACM, where you can manage SSL certificates at no additional cost. CloudFront is integrated with AWS services such as Amazon S3, Amazon EC2, Elastic Load Balancing, Amazon Route 53, and AWS Elemental Media Services. For example, you can easily set up fast CDN for objects stored in S3. CloudFront also works with non-AWS resources, such as website hosted outside AWS services, video streaming from non-AWS servers. You pay per gigabyte rate for data transfer out of edge locations to the end users or into the origins. You also pay for the number of HTTP requests that you receive. CloudFront offers free tier for new customers, including 50 gigabytes data transfer out and 2 million HTTP requests each month for the first year. Origin is the source location where contents are located. It can be an S3 bucket, EC2, Elastic Load Balancer, or even a web server outside AWS. Edge locations are locations where local caches of contents are stored. They are close to your end users. Between origins and edge locations are the Amazon Ultra Fast Global Network Backbone. CloudFront leverages this network to deliver data and cache them in the edge location that is close to end users. Edge locations are separate to AWS regions and availability zones. There are more edge locations than regions and AZs. Distribution allows you to distribute content using a worldwide network of edge locations that provide low latency and high data transfer speeds. When we distribute content with CloudFront, we need to configure the distribution and tell CloudFront information such as delivery method, origin, time to live and security. You can create either web distribution or RTMP distribution in CloudFront. Web distribution is used for static and dynamic content such as CSS, HTML, JavaScript code of your website, real-time streaming, and media files using HTTP or HTTPS protocol. RTMP distribution is for distributing media file streaming with Adobe Flash Media Server's RTMP protocol. CloudFront is discontinuing support for RTMP distributions on December 31, 2020, as fewer websites and applications use RTMP protocol now. Here is how CloudFront CDN works. Suppose you are running a photo sharing website and storing images in an S3 bucket in the US, your users are in Singapore. When users download photos for the first time, they are delivered from the S3 bucket in the US through the CloudFront network and cached in the edge location in Singapore. Later on other users in Singapore can download the cached content from the edge location directly. These contents will be cached in the edge location for the time you specify. This time is called time to live or TTL. When the TTL expires, CloudFront will forward the request to the origin to determine whether the content has been updated. If the content in the origin has been updated, CloudFront will clear the cache in the edge location and fetch the latest version of the content. You can also manually force CloudFront to clear the cache in the edge location. So users can get the latest version of content from the origin. However, you will be charged for manual cache clearing. The same mechanism works in other locations as well. Content will be delivered and cached in the edge locations. From edge locations, the content will be delivered to your end users. Without edge locations, these contents will always have to travel from the origin to end users. You don't need to pay for the data transferred out of S3 into CloudFront. It's much cheaper to use CloudFront than sending data from S3 to your users directly. In this episode, we've learned the basic concept of Amazon CloudFront. CloudFront is the CDN service that securely delivers data, media files, applications, and APIs to customers around the world. CloudFront is integrated with AWS services such as Amazon S3, Amazon EC2, 
Elastic Load Balancing, Amazon Route 53, and AWS Elemental Media Services. You need to understand the basic concept of origin, edge locations, and distribution. Origin is the source location of your content. Edge locations cache the content and deliver them locally. You need to create distribution in CloudFront in order to distribute content. CloudFront CDN uses ultra-fast network to deliver contents and cache them in edge locations close to end users. Okay, that's all for CloudFront. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode. Hope you've enjoyed watching this episode. If you like the video, please help us and hit the like button. If you want to watch more tutorials, please subscribe to the Cloudemy TV channel. Make sure to turn on the notification and stay tuned. At Cloudemy, we're passionate about cloud and AI technology. Please share your feedback and thoughts in the comments below. Feel free to let us know what topics you'd like to watch. Happy watching and happy learning!